Hey, a pleasant good day, everybody. This is Sports Night News. I'm Joe Borick, and this is going to be a video on Team Switzerland having a great win over the ROC to be able to advance to have a chance, obviously, at that point to play in the gold medal game. Unfortunately, though, they fall to Team Canada. They battled, though, and had a great tournament as a whole. Team Switzerland was one of the more impressive teams in the women's circuit got revenge on ROC to have a chance to go up against Team Canada. And then it's just, <clears throat> at that point, yeah, there's a, there's a disparity between the Canadians and most teams in the tournament, other than the U.S. and then Finland's pretty close to most teams. And Switzerland also beat Finland, which was one of their most impressive wins. And Finland just played a very good game against Team USA, that they lost 4-1, to but battled really well, was very good in the face-off dot, battled well, and I'll be doing a recap on that later. But Switzerland's been mighty impressive in this tournament. They definitely deserve to be in the bronze medal game. Unfortunately, to the top-tier teams of the USA and Canada, they did struggle. But against Finland, who's probably the third-best team, uh, they beat them. Against ROC, they lost the initial game, won the most important game, and that's what's most important. So they struggled against teams you would expect them to struggle against in Canada and U.S. Then they beat Finland, then got revenge on ROC. For me, that's a B-plus tournament right now for well, most people probably had them ranked coming in. So now if they can win this bronze medal game, <clears throat> uh, they'll probably still stay at a B-plus because you're winning the bronze compared to the gold. But that's still a very good tournament compared to maybe, I don't know if, Many Again, I'm new to women's hockey, but I don't think from watching this tournament and how the announcers talked about Finland compared to the Americans and um, Canadians, where they would be the team that could kind of compete with them. That's the team that I just kind of took then as who would be the third ranked. Um, Switzerland beat them. They got revenge against ROC. They're now in the bronze medal game. They have a chance to beat Finland again. If they do that, actually, it would probably be more of an A-minus tournament because of how well they did, and then Finland uh, would definitely be more in the C-plus category, because yes, they had some good games uh, in this tournament, but you fell two teams you were favorited against as well, which is not a good thing either. But everybody have a great, safe, and pleasant day. This has been a reaction um, to Switzerland having a very good tournament up to their bronze medal game against Team Canada, yeah, Brandley got shellacked. Mauer got shellacked. They didn't have a chance. There was shots. There was shots galore for Team Canada. Switzerland just isn't there yet to compete with Canada. But over time, it's a patience is a virtue thing. They're building up a good program. Obviously, we saw them have a very good tournament this year. Over time, maybe they will be a team that can upset the Canadians or the Americans. Maybe even by the next Olympics, we'll see. Because they're definitely building up a very strong team with two good netminders in Mauer and Branley as well, who probably could be back for the next eight Olympics, and other players <clears throat> as well who played very swimmingly in this tournament, and hopefully for them continue to play swimmingly in the bronze medal game so they can get a win again over Finland, who would probably not be favored, or probably shouldn't. This game should probably, I think, come in at an even line because I think these teams are just going to battle to the end, and it'll probably be a one-goal game or maybe a two-goal game via an empty net goal or something like that in the bronze medal game. But everybody have a great, safe, and pleasant day. This has been a reaction to Switzerland beating the ROC for a great win and then unfortunately falling to Team Canada 10-3, to but that was kind of two expectations, unfortunately. But they're going to get a chance for a bronze medal, so they're going to get a chance to medal, and that's great for them in Olympic hockey. Peace out, everybody. Stay safe and enjoy your day.